In small farming community of Horton, England, Margaret Backhouse turns the ignition of her husband's car, setting off a pipe bomb filled with nitroglycerin and shotgun pellets. Hundreds of pellets lacerated her body and practically tore away her legs, but she was relatively lucky in that most of the bomb's force was deflected away from her. The explosion came only days after a worker had found a sheep's head impaled on a fence with a note attached that read, You next. Investigators found the impression of a doodle on the back of the threat note. Her husband, Graham Backhouse, Backhouse told police that he had been feuding with a neighbor, Colin Bedale Taylor. Although the police found evidence at Bedale Taylor's house linking him to the bomb, police searched the Backhouse home and found a notebook in drawer showed a doodle that perfectly matched the impression on the threat note. Investigators then pieced together the whole plot. Backhouse had increased his wife's life insurance, created the false threats, set the car bomb, and then, to avoid detection, framed and killed Bedale Taylor. In 1985, Backhouse was convicted and sentenced to life imprisonment.